up, guys? Welcome back to Bourbon Blind, the last episode in the Adam Chapman series. Uh, by now, again, we're filming this ahead of time, but the bar, the studio, Hopefully. filming area should be getting... And paint. Should be done by now. We should be getting super close by now. We are um, on F. I I really think once we can get maybe some paint on the walls, which won't take long. No. Nope. And um, I'm going to go pick out the bar top. And we already have a few barrels and put it out there. And just freaking start filming out there. Yeah. And then just build it as we build it. Yeah. Uh, but that way we can start filming out there because I'm excited and I want to get out there and I want... Oh, I'm so excited. Not you and me both because then we won't have to tear down our kitchen every night. No boss. Adam, thank you so much for this for real. amazing journey. Uh, we've been doing Adam bottles now for And talk six about some weeks. awesome freaking bottles. Yeah, I mean... And some unusual bottles. I mean, we, I haven't liked them all, but that's okay. And that's what makes it awesome. Um, I have absolutely loved most of them. Um, I think there's only one that I didn't like. Don't quote me on that. But, or I shouldn't say didn't like. And I will say they're all... They're very all different. Very unique bottles. Yes. Uh, there was a 2014 Jack Daniels. That was um, good. <clears throat> some Burai, Burai, Burai. Uh, just all kinds of stuff, man, and stuff you don't see normally, and barrel pick makers, and... Did you water that? I did not. Um, totally interrupted. We'll take a little bit more out of there. So, yeah, super appreciate it. Um, I put a drop and a half. I overdid mine. Boom! Now you overdid it. Boom sauce. Anywho, we really appreciate it. Um, um, there is, if you have Bourbon Blind Nation coins, uh, they are metal. And uh, there's a nice ring on they the fit. underside. Look. And it'll lock into your glass, man. Uh, speaking of glasses, we do have glasses finally available. Uh, as you notice, we have a full set of Bourbon Blind glasses now. Um, usually I was buying them and... Selling them as fast as we could get them on. People were buying them, or yeah, buying them. And I was like, man, I got to keep one for myself. This is like a fruit. Brown sugar, leather, molasses. And fruit. Fruit? Fruit. This is um, really like a caramel bomb and a vanilla bomb with fruit. It tastes like... Lots of caramel. My mouth's like watering. Brown sugar, molasses, all that really dark sugar. Pudding with fruit. Mm. Like vanilla pudding with fruit or vanilla... You don't eat your fruit. You can't have any more pudding. I don't know what that's from, but Okay. Oh, if you don't eat your meat. Don't know what that's from either. How can you have any pudding if you don't eat your meat? It's from uh, the walking music video. Uh, someone in the comments will know what the hell I'm talking about. But Thank God somebody does, because your wife sure as hell has no Another point. brick in the wall, Pink Floyd. Pink Floyd, another brick in the wall. That's the one you watch with The Wizard of Oz. Try again. It's all instrumental. I, I know I'm right. Put it in the comments. I've done the whole... I'm probably thinking of something else. Don't tell her that. <laughs> Earmuffs. Earmuffs. <laughs> I might be wrong. <laughs> I can guarantee you are, because I've done the whole... Guarantee is a strong word. Someone prove me wrong, please. I, I, I'm willing to admit Hashtag wrong. Aaron's wrong in the comments. Uh, you so, said a lot to drink. Let's get in here. This smells fantastic. Cheers to you. Cheers to me. Cheers to you guys for making a freaking awesome Facebook group. Cheers to Adam for sending us amazing bourbon. Wow. The baking spice on this is almost an overload. It's tons of baking spice. <laughs> yeah. It's vanilla and baking spice, and it's kind but of off-putting in some ways. It's kind not of cool. super spicy. Uh, For me, it's like that earthy spice. I'm getting baking soda, but I love baking soda. Like, so, like a good, like a good Indian food. You know what I mean? Um, not necessarily like a curry or anything like that, but you lost <clears> me at Indian food. It's it's that earthy 
spiciness. It's not, it's not like ginger clove kind of spicy. It's, oh, but it is. I don't know. It's, it's I'm getting way more all of them. those, like, the, like especially that. like ginger. Like, it's got like wasabi heat to it, and then it just disappears. It just be crazy. Is what it is. Mm. I mean, it is pretty delicious. It is. It's I'm like, say that. but it definitely has like a wasabi effect because it like burns my mouth. And then it's gone. I am actually getting that now. You're still wrong about the song, though. I'm not wrong about the song, just like I'm not wrong about the flavor. <clears throat> it's a vanilla, like, constant and a caramel constant, but it definitely has, like, a wasabi or ginger. I think it's Spiciness is, like, right here, right now. That's because like, you drank feel, it too fast. I, I let it sit spiciness. in my mouth. I can feel the spiciness. I let it sit in my mouth, too. You know, freaking amateur, the amateur hour. And apparently, because <clears throat> I mean, usually, but you know, I didn't get it in my, I didn't get it, I didn't get it down here, but I definitely got it in the mouth. <laughs> and yes, that's what she said. That's literally what she just said. It is. So on the mm. watered down version, more spice. Like this is a uh, more sweet on the nose or on the palate. Oh, well, I haven't smelled it. Mm-hmm. More toned down on the nose, but... Mm. There's definitely some ethanol notes with the water. I don't like it with the Not water. Not bad, though. No, it's got some astringent flavors, too. It is, but it's... Eh. Don't water this down. I mean, I wouldn't, you know. I might actually put it over some ice. It's all you, boo. But... You do you. I won't. I know. Ice over bourbon. And bourbon over ice is a sin to some people, but... Yeah. To your wife? If if Pappy can do it, I can do it. Hey, you know, you do you. I like my bourbon straight. I do too. But Nine not, times out of ten. Not cold. Every now and then, though, it's super hot outside, and just like some wild turkey 101 over ice, delicious. I like mixing it with lemonade. Delicioso. Also, yep, or putting in a hot toddy. Ooh. You do like a good hot toddy. I do. As far as this one goes, though, it's it's really good. I would be. I say fifty bucks. I was gonna say fifty to sixty, maybe seventy. Fifty bucks, like straight up. I would feel comfortable at sixty. I would. Nope. 70 might be pushing it. 70 is totally pushing it. For you. I'm cheap. cheap. We know this. I don't buy the liquor in our house. I just drink it. And when you have like the collection that we have and I can readily grab almost anything in my little heart's desire, it's kind of scary. But then again, I hear how much bottles we have and then that's really scary. So. But it's so awesome because now you have choices. Women love choices. Yeah, until you're like looking at the... At <laughs> I saw it. Oh, that's awesome. And guess what? Oh. I was almost spot on. No, no, I wasn't. I take that back. I saw the percentage and I thought it was the dollars. So this is a Four Roses single barrel OBSF nine year, four months. It was the NOLA Bourbon Festival Ooh. 2019. And it runs in at 115 crew or 115, yes. Yes. 115.6 crew. 57.8 for you other people. And it runs $80 in Louisiana plus tax. So, uh, Which is kind of what Four Roses, they increase their pricing on their single barrels. That's really tragic. Barrel strength. Um, I well, know you used to be able to find them for like 55, 60 bucks and it was Which was amazing. spot on. I mean, it literally amazing. was. At 70 bucks, it's. That's high. Not that I wouldn't pay 70 bucks for Four Roses picks because Y'all know I love my four roses. Um, I do but too, it, but at, when it started giving up like yeah, 80 bucks, 80 like, bucks there's so much to get, more. You can hey, find, Brent, don't do that. Brent doesn't have anything to say about pricing. We need to cut that out. <laughs> I'm gonna text Brent. <laughs> yeah, we need to talk to some people. But well, uh, at I'm, $80, it's getting, it, that's tough pushing. I don't it, know. It is. Um, I will say now that 
seeing what it is. F yeast, I usually get more floral on it, and I could definitely see that. Obviously, I know what it is now, but still had like some finish going when I saw what it was, and I was like, that makes sense. Oh, it was good, but I don't know if it's eighty dollars good. Maybe I need to taste more <sighs> bourbon, and maybe I need to like readjust my price. It, it is a single; it's a single barrel, so it is. And if I this mean, was maybe, and there might be something to be said because this is the New Orleans Bourbon Festival two thousand nineteen um, pick. pick, and uh, if you weren't yeah. there, we're sorry; you totally missed us. It you was missed amazing. Out. Um, twenty twenty. Still haven't heard, although. Right. I have a conference for work that was supposed to be in New Orleans in October. It's gone online. I'm not sure how that's going to work, but um, <clears throat> it's... Uh, not looking it's, good. Yeah, the state of affairs right now, not great. So, so in the meantime, whatever. we really appreciate all of y'all uh, from the nation who have come out. And hopefully. Hopefully. Oh, I'm so excited. Next time you guys see us, we should be in the new studio. It probably won't be finished, but by golly, we'll be in there. Oh, that would be that would be. Oh, I'm so excited. That would warm my heart. Ugh. That would warm the tackles of my heart. I am like overjoyed right now. Aaron knows me. How many times do I get like this? <laughs> Almost never. <laughs> I don't think he was this excited about marrying me. Was I supposed to be? Is that out loud? Earmuffs. <laughs> Earmuffs. <laughs> Anywho. Until Friday, noon central next week, cheers and drink blind. Blindly drink. Catch us also 9.30 on Fridays. Live. Live. We want to give a huge shout out to all of our Patreon people. Absolutely thank you. You guys are freaking magical. T-shirts at Teespring, link in the description. Also, thank you to anyone who has ever supported us, whether that's either coming on a live, chit-chatting with us on a Thursday night, or if you just like to watch our episodes, we appreciate every one of you. Until Friday, noon central next week. Cheers.